Hi, I'm Patty Shimakawa, and uh, I moved to Santa Cruz with my family six years ago. And uh, I have this statement here, but first of all, I wanted to say that uh, we moved three years ago into a beautiful four-bedroom house on Milk Circle that was built in 2007 by local builder Randy Palmer. And I have my um, most recent water bill here from 10:12 to 11:19, and we used a of 129 gallons of water per day, which comes out to um, including me, my husband, my 21 year old daughter, and my 17 year old son. Fully landscaped yard with 10 fruit trees, 15 rose bushes, grapevines, and I invite any of you to come by anytime to my beautiful yard. Like 32 gallons per day. And I, I feel like we're not really trying that hard. And um, so that was really meaningful to me in light of the water debate today that I feel like the desalination plants should be like a totally, totally last resort and I'm really concerned about the legacy that my generation is leaving for our children and I want to see <laughs> leadership that is future oriented in terms of not trying to solve our problems from old style thinking but generating like the passions in the hearts and minds of our young people to really buy into a vibrant future for for all of us and um i have information here that as a west side resident i'm going to be the main recipient of this desal water concerned about that um i love the lifestyle in santa cruz and somehow like the desal plant just somehow doesn't jive with my image of living in Santa Cruz and knowing how many problems there can be with uh, membranes and Thank you, technology, kind of bummed out about it. Thank you.